I had to do this shit right quick. Lord mad, motherfucking black moon. I fucked up. <laughs> I thought about it. God damn. You know who I am, motherfucker. God damn it. Shit. So I'm over here listening to this Epstein. I don't know nothing about this man. I've been hearing about it for a week or two. Um, I heard him go to jail. I didn't know what the fuck he went to jail for. I thought he was running a sex ring. But now I'm hearing prostitute ring or fucking pedophilia ring. And it's making me angry. Like, I'm trying to get through this fax video. So, my plan is to release this. And, um, I'm going to release this on YouTube about, like, the introduction. And then I'm going to do the actual video after I get the fax on Anchor FM. Which will be put on Google and, um, Stitcher and things like that. So, basically, just to give you my problem with it. These niggas are saying about this Epstein nigga... Yada yada pedophile ring where powerful people used to go and and you know be able to do pedophile shit and it's like well what happened with Alex Jones when y'all was trying to take his kid away calling him crazy because of the things he talk about that's literally the shit that Alex Jones talk about the people at the top are pedophiles and they keep it a secret and they go to secret islands where they have sex with kids and sacrifice them these niggas is talking about this nigga Epstein had an island where they was doing all this pedophile shit and he had pagan statues there. This is exactly the shit this nigga was talking about. This nigga Alex Jones, he got a video, I don't know if it's real, but he snuck into some spot where they was doing like fake ritual shit and they had pagan statues, nigga. So it's like, you be so ready to destroy a nigga life because the government or the media tells us that something that somebody said is absurd or they lying or yada yada, you know, just like the WikiLeaks nigga, we entirely ready to destroy somebody's life. But we ain't thinking about why ain't nobody checking into this shit, you know? The government has the full authority to say, hey, that don't make no sense. That's not credible. We not going to check into that. Meanwhile, it was just a thousand cops outside just fucking with niggas. You know what I'm saying? But this nigga able to kill himself because he in, he in some next shit, right? I don't know if he got transferred, but from what I'm hearing, he was in some ball in prison where he was just doing whatever he wanted. I don't know if they transferred him. So either way, they gave him too much freedom and he killed himself, or he had too much freedom and realized that this shit just got real and then killed himself. Either way, we don't need to be thinking about him. We need to think about who the fuck was at them parties, who was on that island. Because if we talking about powerful people, Fuck that. We don't even need to think about that. If the world ain't Illuminati and the world is just fucked up, then that means somebody could have possibly killed that man for the sake of keeping secrets. Because if he fuck with powerful niggas, that means he got information on people. So what you think? They're going to kill him so he can't talk. That's it. Just a fucking intro. See me on Anchor, nigga, or hear me because you can't see me on that bitch. It's all audio. You know, catch me on that. I'm out. Real Nigga News on Anchor, Black Moon Pack. Look it up. Something like that. I'm out. Peace.